Hey, it's James Nicholson. I hope you're well. And I want to talk to you today about a common problem that lots of business owners up and down the country have, and that's when we call it feast and famine. And what do I mean by that is that often you get business owners and we work with business owners and come across people that say that they're very, very busy. They can't necessarily work on marketing in their business because right now they're too busy. Then what happens is after they've done all that work, they've got all that business out of the way, then they go through a period of what we call famine, meaning that they don't have any customers. They didn't have the next customer ready to work with them. Now, not every business has that problem, do they? There are lots of businesses that have got loads of customers, in fact, waiting or queuing to work with them. And how they've done that is to make sure that they've got a consistent lead flow. What you'll also find with those businesses is that invariably they charge more. Even though they've got more customers waiting uh, to work with them, they're more expensive than the people that are going through the feast and famine. And that's why it's important to have a strategy in place, a system in place that's constantly bringing you new leads. So when you're looking for people to work with, the next person to work with, you're not going to get desperate. You're not going to just pick whoever comes along first and thus beating down your prices, uh, thus making it so your um, working with someone that you might not want to work with because let's be honest we've all worked with someone previously that we just knew in our gut wasn't going to be someone that would be really lighting us up wouldn't make us passionate about working with them they we knew that they could be a little difficult to work with so it's important that you don't have that problem you don't have feast and famine and you get over that by making sure you've got a consistent lead flow so you do that with a five-step system first you start with content that gives value to an audience position you as an expert then you capture leads then you need to book an appointment with those people or sell them something that's the third step and that's um, to turn them into a customer then at that stage you look to sell them your core offer and then you sell more to your existing customers as well because let's be honest it's easier to get better fees better relationship with your existing customers as well so having that lead flow is the key to avoiding feast and famine and we show you how to do that if you want to come along to one of our boot camps we can show you in four hours how you can set that system up in any business and what I'll do for you is I'll put a link around this video so you can book yourself on come along to one of the boot camps and see Jessen and myself and our team and we'll help you map out exactly how you can get that working the right way in your business so I'd like to know how you've got this working in your business or maybe you're currently in feast and famine and need some help. Comment below and I'll help you. I'll reply to all the comments. Jess and will as well. And give us some likes and some hearts. That pushes this video out to more entrepreneurs and business owners so they can see these videos. And the other thing you could do is tag other entrepreneurs and business owners below because I'm sure you know other business owners that could benefit from these videos. If you tag them below, it will share it with them so they can check us out and like this page as well. So that's it from me. I love your feedback. Do comment below and I'll see you guys soon. Bye for now.